Hello, uh, my name is CJ Jackson and I am the creative consultant at the Seafood School based above Billingsgate Market. My name's Jamie from Robocoop, I'm the key account manager. Um, today we've brought Runwood Care here to Billingsgate to get some experience with, for the chefs, um, to use some fresh food and obviously the fresh fish, um, helping them to find solutions obviously when it comes to the equipment as well. Today we have run the Runwood and Sanders Senior Living Chef Competition. That's quite a mouthful. It's also great to see the talent of the chefs in the kitchen at the moment. They're doing a ready, steady cook, which is absolutely fabulous. We've waited a couple of years to host the event um, and the idea around it really is to showcase the talent that we have within our homes uh, and bring them together um, for a special occasion to celebrate food. Well, we're going to start uh, the competition now. 60 minutes to produce your winning dish. Good luck. Hi, I'm Craig. Um, I'm from Lower Meadow um, in Stratford. Today I will be cooking um, smoked haddock and prawn pie. Hi, I'm CJ. I'm from Madeleine Court in Essex and I'll be cooking the Black Forest cake today. Hi, I'm Oscar, I'm from the Belmont and I'm cooking some pan-fried sea bass with some crushed new potatoes and a white wine sauce. Michael Cohen, head chef from Red Bond Lodge in Great Dunmo. Um, cooking a lightly spiced cot cottage pie with a root vegetable mash, honey glazed sprouts and paprika roasted cauliflower. Hi, I'm Thomas. Uh, I'm a head chef in Ivy Court Doncaster. I'm cooking today brownie with uh, pecan nuts and raspberry sweet sauce. I'm Gary from Leewood Manor, the kitchen manager. Um, today for the competition Chef of the Year 2022, I'm going to be cooking pan seared lamb rump with a spring onion infused mashed potato braised red cabbage, minted pea puree, a carrot puree, and a red wine jus. So the competition is going really, really well. In the kitchen, I've seen the chefs, the standard of food is really, really good, and I'm really excited to try the food come the end of the competition. I don't think there's any losers. This is the first time it's been been run for Runwood Homes. Um, it, it's great to come in first place. Um, it, it really is. Um, but I think it's it, it's long overdue. Um, the fact that people in catering in the care homes is starting to get recognised, and that we can get it out there, and that we can build and actually push the standards and the levels up. Um, because for too many years now, it's been overlooked. I think so. The fact that Runwood Homes and Chris and James are doing this kind of creates awareness and you know, something onwards and upwards and hopefully the same again next year. I'm more worried I'd be. Just a little one. It's, yeah. All right, cool, cut there. That was my happy face for you.